Hello and welcome back here friends from Odo. We are back in our campaign of Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous. Last time we found the brother of Staunton Wayne down in the dungeons. He's not really bound here, he's just stupidly mad and therefore we thought it would be a good idea to kill him. I mean I know if my companions fought it, but I'm pretty sure if we don't kill him here, we will have to kill him later on. So, let's do this. So, Joran Wayne is a level 13 cleric. I thought he was a blacksmith. And now he's, he's suddenly a cleric who's probably, who's probably making some really stupid things like holy fire or something like that. But he's flat footed right now and he's just got 127 hit points. Mm. His flat footed defense is 34. How should we hit this guy? Okay. <laughs> okay, we don't have a bless, so let's bless everyone. He's like a... Okay, let's see. We have some magic missiles and stuff like that. Ooh, wait. This just makes a touch attack. And his touch AC is really really weak. It's just the demon. Even then you can do that. You rolled a one? Really? Oh, man, you... Why? Why? Come on, Keith. You can hit him. I'm pretty sure about that. Yay! First blood! Pig, you're great. <laughs> I don't think that we will hit him with any arrows. So probably I should do some other things. How about uh, Cat's Grace on... How about Instrument of Freedom? What's that? With the characters that draw their power from freedom gain an ability to unleash a bolt of energy from Elysium. Yeah, like this. Lawful Neutral. Ooh! Well done, Spell! Let's move down there. Just to be not too much clustered around. Let's do the luck thing on like right. Rachel does need, need 20s as well to hit him. Okay, Nenyo, let's go back to magic missiles. They always hit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
pig. Come on. That's that. We killed Chor and Wayne. Good. Good. It's locked. There is loot. What's that? Ah, we found the Sword of Europeth. That's nice. What is this? They are in the forges, heavy with the supernatural power coming from the end building. The pulses are through the forges, not the heat of an ordinary fire. Yeah, that's probably because we are right next to the abyss. I'm not sure if I want to move along this point. This sounds really not nice. Mm. But it doesn't do anything to my people. Oops. No, not again. Charisma. Damage. The Finnish Minotaur. Hmm. He did the prayer already, and we got the negative effect. That's not nice of him. But the um, the Minotaur is hit easily. It's just a big cow standing around. Yeah, man, you. Come on. Get rid of the yes before it could do its first hit. Oh, we found cold iron and stuff we don't need. A simple straw bed made to last built with dwarven solidity. Okay. Lot of stuff. Okay. There are two ways down, down here and down there. Not sure which would be the best way. Hmm. hmm. And there's a trap again. that the cat won't trigger the trap.
No, you are not in trouble. Ah, this is so bad. We need some scoundrel here. It's not okay that we can't fix the trap problem. Yeah, this was stupid. Thanks a lot for nothing. At least we have mess healing around. Okay, let's move into the next door. Ah, I know where we are. That's good. So if we approach slowly, we probably have some advantage in this fight. And we will have a fight, I'm pretty sure about that. Okay. There is some really big thing out there. So we probably should boost ourselves before we go into this fight. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, you should take this person. I should use this one as well. No, all wisdom. That's too bad. Hmm. Hmm, there is an Alps Wisdom. Is this acid, cold, electricity, fire, hmm. protection from good, from law, both we won't need probably. Chaos and evil would be good. Um, I mean, we could do some entanglement up front. We have some place for that. It's quite interesting as an idea. We would be slow in getting out and we make most of the damage with our rule of good hope. That's great. This one will do. Okay. You will do this. This you will do this. Yes, there is a reason to pause. Um so big. You've still got the magic fangs and the acid more. Mm. 
Let's do this. Okay, and now let's do some tailwind. Up front. You'll stay here, pig. You'll go just there and wait for them to come. You too. Okay. So let's get rid of this guy. Because it tries to do some magic from inside. Ah, uh, yes. There comes the Minotaur. This guy. Hmm. Yay. No, not an icy prison again. This was so bad last time we had it. Please kill this evoker. If it doesn't do anything stupid again. Thank you. Okay, need some healing.
Mm -hmm. mm, it. <laughs> Take this monitor. That's it. Good. This was well planned for the first time in a long time. <laughs> um. So now we just have to wait to get rid of this entanglement. I can't do it for myself, so I have to wait. Um, how long does this does this stay there? How many minutes? One minute per level, so eight minutes. Hmm. Yeah, anyway, I will do this in between episodes. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time soon. Bye.